This is a game between Tibia and uh, Musket Jr. on the WAVs version of Great Plains. Let's see if the game will start. I hope it does start. Might freeze here. No, it will start. Um, it's a decent hunt here for Tibia. Right in front of his TC. It's uh, French against Spain, by the way. Musket Jr. being Spain. And not a very good hunt here for Musket Jr. But it should suffice um, just to get through. And if he hears this one early... Um, <laughs> If you're making a little joke about uh, a cast I did yesterday with him where I forgot to turn on my mic. Um, yeah, it's still new to this, so uh, it won't happen now, though. This is a, a very nice matchup, I would say. If the hunts are e uh, are good for both players, um, a very even matchup, I think. Spain, I would say, have has the edge because Spain, if played properly, is the most OP civ in the game. But you can't really afford to make any mistakes as uh, Spain against French. If you do make a mistake, French eco will just be too good, their units will be too good, and you just won't be able to, to win it. <coughs> Let's see uh, the treasures. Musket Jr. going for that coin treasure. I did not see what star he has, sorry for that, but um, yeah. Um, some coin treasure always nice because it means he will be able to age a little bit faster. He doesn't need to get a hundred coin because he probably will have some little coin treasures here. Um, I think he just had a hundred wood start because a player like Musket Jr. I would expect to leave his hundred coin if he does not do a market and he has a hundred coin. Um, the herd quite good there. Asking if he used shot. I'm not sure. Tibia going here to put up. I don't know, wall segments maybe, that's a very very early, and Tibia got 140 food, um, he'll probably do a rush, he'll, he'll probably do a, a musket rush with 30 fill age up. Um, I'm surprised if we won't be seeing that from him because he sensed it. He, he, yeah, he, well musket scouted that luckily, but um, he sent his vill forward very early there and Tibia now <laughs> realizing his mistake uh, because Musket told him that if Musket had not told him that he would have had a big advantage because now Tibia will have time to to react to this he knows now that Musket knows he will be rushing uh, he might still try it if he does it will probably be a short game uh, with the victor not known but it will probably be short if he decides to back off now we might see a more long, a longer game. Uh, because of that, actually, I now notice that Musket Jr. map is quite shit. He just has one mine, even though it's located all right. It's just one mine. And with a shitty hunt, you at least want two mines to have the option to go uh, mercenaries. This option is now pretty much negated. <coughs> Let's check their decks. Musket Jr. having um, oh, that's something that I actually forgot about Musket Jr. He likes to play H2 Spain, going for that semi FF or even full out H2 uh, battle, and he, you can see in his deck that that's reflected there. He does not have eight pike. I'd say eight pike is still a little bit better than six Rodaleros, uh, so you should probably not put in six if you do not have eight pike. He has four or five vills. Um, all the crates that you need for a longer H2 battle and uh, his H3 deck is uh, quite decent there don't know perhaps um, four lances would be better than eight raw arrows depends on who you're facing I guess um, sorry Tibia's deck now Tibia's deck uh, rather standard French deck has Swiss spike and they're always nice against Spain uh, not very good for H2 long age to battles but he has all he needs basically uh we'll probably see him semi ff after all he's not up yet so he went for that 14 village after all 
they're both aging up to about the same time. Tibia going for a 50 musk semi most likely. <coughs> and let's see what Musket Jr. Musket Jr. starting Musketeer as well. If Musket Jr. starts double racks with his uh, placement here, he will be in an advantageous position because he has dogs. He has uh, he can ship units from his tower directly onto the racks. He can take down that racks. But still, if that happens, I would say um, Tibia, well, if he if Tibia handles this right, he can actually use this because Spain is quite unflexible. They're very strong, but they're unflexible. They, 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 you have to pick the right build from the start and stick to that because um, you cannot just, like French do, um, go for a semi-FF and then stay in H2 or go for an for uh, for H2 and then quickly age because Spain does not have fast age they do not their eco is slow to kick in um, so Musket Jr. has to commit here he has to commit to H2 a semi FF will put him behind he will age way slower he loses two dogs here that's a pity <coughs> that's a pity um, Let's see what happens. He's adding a stable here. Not sure why. I'm not sure if that's the best choice. I think I would. I would like to have. I would like to see him uh, have added a second barracks here, just to power through. Really. Uh, I mean, he's Tibia is obviously sticking on one racks. He's going for that semi FF that many French players prefer against Spain. That can be quite effective in this case with bad hunts. Um, I'd say. Musket loses one musketeer here, and um, his army is not in position as well as that of Tibia's. So, um, Tibia losing one musket or no musket, really. I'm not sure. I think he lost one. And um, Musket Jr. losing two there. So, um, that went better for Tibia, but not a real big difference there. <laughs> I think Tibia, Tibia should, uh, Musket Jr. should be sieging this uh, this barracks. He should have done that from the start, because this tower provides a uh, range here. He can just walk back and forth if Tibia def decides to defend it, and he can pop seven rods from that tower. He will now catch this musket army here, and he will kill a few there, a few free shots, getting fire. He gets one off before Tibia realizes it, and then the seven rods come in. So. Uh, four four cav here, so Mosca Jr. will mop this up, but Tibia will most likely already be aiding at the moment. But uh, he ran out of his first hunt, so he will be stuck on this hunt. He'll, if he does not age soon, he will lose this game because of that. <coughs> he added a stable way too far out. I think he will lose that stable. Um... He needs to send Minutemen right now before he loses too many much more Musketeers. And then also pull some Vils, I think. Uh, Minutemen and the Vils, and then he'll be able to hold this off. Otherwise, he'll just lose the game outright. Um, some untraditional play here by Musket Jr., but still quite effective. Spain, uh, something that uh, many people do not necessarily realize, is also quite good in age 2 although it requires... Um, some more, not necessarily skill, but some more, don't know the right word for it, some more perseverance perhaps, you need to play a bit, it's not as easy, let's just stick to that, it's not as easy, because uh, as I said, it's rigid, so if, if you do not do the right build to counter what your opponent does, you'll be stuck in H2, and you don't want to be stuck in H2 as Spain for too long. Um, I think it's a good time now for Musket Jr. to add some uh, some uh, TPs. Tibia decided not to go for that age. I think that's a good choice after all. Although Musket Jr. should have taken down this uh, barracks here. He should have done that before pushing out here. He's now ahead in points. Tibia running out of hurt, safe hurt, so... If Musket realizes that and puts some some uh, some some aggressive raids, 
all over the map splitting up in different positions he, he'll be able to to take it down he just now is going for one position seeing this army of tibia here deciding to pull back still going for that raid here in the corner he saw the death hunts most likely and we'll try to go for a raid he it is denied if he does look at the map though he will see this dead hunt he will see this dead hunt and he'll know he has to push out there now he's going for this engagement i think he went in too soon losing some rodaleros losing some calf not a very smart choice there i'd say uh, he should back up right now and this is really a, a, the case where French has the advantage over over Spain, even though it's not really uh, portrayed in the game at the moment. But French can now just ship 700 coin and go for that age. And they won't be in much trouble. Spain, on the other hand, cannot do that. They have a slow age. That two-minute age will just really take too long. A nice interception there by Tibia getting a little bit lucky. <coughs> denying that TP, which is uh, quite important there for for Tibia, that he denied that he is running these vills here, knowing that this won't be safe any longer. That definitely Musket Jr. will be coming along this path as he does. Uh, nice reaction there from Tibia, or actually actually uh, pro action. He uh, he will be behind in terms of points, so I think. Uh, musket will have boomed quite a lot. No, no four vills actually. Um, I would have expected that he'll 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 be able to save his five calf there. I'd say that Tibia could have done that better. Um, Tibia probably going for that age. I'm not sure, but he should do that really. He's adding another barracks. He lost his first one, so that does not mean anything he could be putting up for skirmishers he put it he could be putting it up for musketeers I don't know um, I think it's better for him to age though because musket is just ahead and if Tibia does not add at least two barracks he will never be able to catch up um, rather is being very effective of course against uh, <coughs> against cavalry team player asking who I think will win I'm saying it depends on uh, whether or not um, Tibia ages now. If he does age, he still has a shot. If he waits too long, Musket Jr. will either age or mess too much. I think I think Musket... Well, Tibia is going to, to continue to make Musketeers. I think that's a mistake for the reasons I stated. He has a lot of Cav, but Musket Jr. is... Um, Rodaleros and Musketeer heavy army, so there's no point really although this raid here might turn into the advantage of tibia but no he really does not get too many vills actually just three two two three there and he loses all his calf this was such a mistake and this is why i would say never raid with all your calf just three calf there would have done enough damage if it was undefended and if it was defended to lose three calf is not a big deal to lose 13 or whatever it was amount I think 13 13 calf that's a huge deal we can see the points dropping there musket jr actually aging before tibia does and now tibia is in such a bad spot he does not have any calf to to counter the skirmishers that will soon be popping out from musket jr uh, uh, Mus uh, Husser is doing good against Lancers as well. He does not have uh, a good counter against that either, of course. Uh, <coughs> to be apologizing here, no, realizing that that move cost him the game. He has some Musketeers, but it's just not enough. Some Vils here getting caught out of position, more must getting caught out of position, and the game is just rapidly falling apart here for Tibia. He does not have what it takes. He'll he'll lose his army, and that will be GG. There it is, GG.